Hey guys, welcome to the second video I've recorded in this apartment. Uh, I would probably record more if the apartment wasn't so damn far away from the train station and I could actually bring my stuff here without it being a huge hassle, but I will get into that later. So, um, I don't think I showed everything. Um, there's the table from Ikea. I was gonna set that up. Um, again, that kind of emphasizes the fact I'm not here as much as I would like to, so there's not a lot of free time. Like, as soon as I'm done with class on Thursday, I'm headed straight back to home. So, you know, not a lot of free time to really do anything except for studying, you know, assignments, uh, more studying, more reading, and then, you know, it's back home. So, um, I did clean up a little bit. Um, I got some more stuff here. Um, I don't think I showed um, the pool last time. So, um, there you go. This is what it looks like. You'd be kind of uh, foolish to do that right now because um, it is October and it is cold. It's also very windy, so I would not recommend. But, yeah, so there is um, some more stuff here. Um, just got the books and whatnot. Um, I did dust a little bit. Uh, you know, just normal housekeeping things. I'm just making sure everything is, you know, tidy and whatnot because, you know, I like to not live in an untidy place, you know, I think that's a, I think that's pretty universal, but anyways, um, this is the most important room, um, my bedroom, and, uh, da da da, -da lots of, uh, nothing, because, uh, yeah, to really emphasize that even more, there's the TV, I, I don't even have the TV set up, because, again, it is really tough to get my stuff here, it's not like, um, University Square, where it's like a three minute walk from the train station, um, here, actually, let me, uh, look it up on my phone right now. I can really emphasize that, but really it takes me, God, by walking, I think it takes me 35 minutes to get here. Um, let me just look up the Davis Amtrak on my phone. Uh, there we go. Okay, it's 1.6 miles away, so there we go. It's, uh, can you focus? It's 2.2 miles from my location right now, so it is a bit of a walk, <laughs> depending on how many, uh, oh, that's for driving. Here, let me show you how far it is when I have to, uh, walk there there we go so 48 minutes but i power walk so you know i get it a little bit quicker than that but yeah it's pretty it's pretty far so it's really tough to get my stuff here and like it's a big enough problem lugging my two laptops on top of like all my clothes and whatnot so not the easiest so unfortunately um that really does put like it really hampers what i can do here and let's see if i can actually uh see um is that good? It's uh, well, it's about as good as we're. Oh God, okay, well, that's about as good as we're gonna get it. Um, how use my? Actually, I want to use my phone to emphasize the fact uh, why I got a. Uh, this is such an issue. Okay, I'll just use my hand. So, anyways, so uh, yeah, like I would love to record here, and especially right now when Call of Duty is, you know, it's it's newly released. Like I have to be like getting it like that, 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 but. I can't because I'm here for three days of the week and that really just makes it tough. So I do apologize for that and really like this all really came to the forefront when I had my 24th birthday, which was, you know, two days ago. I really had to think of like, man, like I'm 24 and I don't think I have the leisure time to be doing this as, oh, someone's got their car started. <laughs> That's another thing, like I'm right next to the parking lot. so. Yeah, that would also not be great picking that up in the recording, but, you know, I'm 24 right now, so, you know, I really have to think about, like, what I'm going to be doing, like, you know, money, investing, jobs, and whatnot. I probably don't have the time to be just playing video games all the time like I normally used to, so I really got to think about my future, so, yeah, you know, it, it's just not easy. Like, it really just hit me up, like, when I, when I had my 24th birthday. And, like, especially here, like, when I'm not recording games, there's not much for me to do except think. And so I'm really thinking, like, man, I I really got to, like, do something right now or I am fucked. Like, I really, really have to because, like, your 20s is when you really set the path. Like, your, your work ethic, your money, like, now's a great time. Like, I can afford to, like, when you're 20 or, like, 20, I want to say probably 21 to like, you know, 28, 27, 29, like, you can afford to live like, you know, like a poor college student, which, you know, I have my own apartment, so I really can't say that, you know, I'm really thankful for that uh, 529 account for, um, that was set up by my grandparents and my parents, so, you know, I'm really thankful for that, and, you know, my part-time job so I can pay for uh, my living expenses, like, you know, food and whatnot, but, like, you can afford to, like, be that trashy or have that you know trashier lifestyle like you know you don't have to live in luxury because like people don't expect you to so you can afford to do that but once you become like 35 38 36 like you better like be living in a house or something like that and having a stable job because 
that's expected of you. So, man, like that, all that really hit me like right then and there. Um, and yeah, I, I think it's kind of translated into the videos, like especially like for Call of Duty. Like I'm recording the like I'm recording the music, guys. Like for um, the soundtracks, which I promised you guys, like I am doing that. I just keep getting cut off because hey, you got to go to work, and then hey, you got to get on a train. So I get interrupted like partway through because you know right right here, you guys can see like I do have that. This is my recording laptop. Like this one right here is my recording laptop, and this one's my editing laptop. This one's just more powerful, so you know it can deal with you know recording very high quality gameplay, like you know 1080p, 60 FPS. So you know that's why I use this one. Like, it isn't actually a gaming laptop from, like, oh, God, um, was it 2017, I think? So it's an older one, but it's still much better than this one. This is a 2014 laptop. So, you know, I try to make things last as long as possible. So, you know, I'm trying to get that, you know, resourcefulness. And to really il illustrate that, um, I'm going to show you guys, like, why. Like, I'm in a save money kind of mentality, even though, like, it doesn't really show that from, like, you know, oh, you're recording YouTube, which is, like, the most bougie hobby in the goddamn world. And I get that. I do get that. Like, I've been doing this for... Oh wow, I forgot to do the um, anniversary, like my seven year anniversary of doing YouTube. I think it was October 2nd. Oh no, I fucking forgot. God damn it, there was so much going on. I, I think it's October 2nd, but um, yeah. So I did have my seventh anniversary of doing this as a hobby. And uh, yeah, uh, well, I fucked up on that for sure. Um, I do that pretty much every year. I always have something I mess up on every single year, but let me, um, let's see. I always walk to school just because like I don't want to rely on um, I rely on having a, well, come on now. Yeah, I don't want to rely on um, a bus system, which could potentially make me late to class, so I'd like to walk. So this is what it looks like. This is my walking route. I do this every single time I go to class. Are you going to focus? No, okay, don't focus on me. Focus on, come on, come on, come on. You can do it. Can you guys see that? So 39 minutes. I walk 39 minutes to and from school every single time I go to school. I, I don't take bus. I don't have my car with me. So again, like I'm trying to save money I suppose so like I'm not gonna uber everywhere because that really adds up like from let's see train station to here I think it's seven dollars and so to do that multiple times and like I guess to my school it'd be like you know five bucks or something like that so you know I hate being late to class I always like being early to class at least by 15 minutes so that's why I don't like using the bus because you know the bus has its set schedule and it not, doesn't necessarily correlate with my schedule so um, yeah, that's why I don't do it. I know it's a really stupid reason. I used to take bus all the time to school in high school and middle school, but I don't know. I just, I like, I like being in control, I guess, if that makes any sense. But anyway, so <laughs> I guess, I don't know where this deep talk is going, but, um, anyway, so basically this year may be iffy. Like, you know, I, I do want to keep playing video games. Of course I do. Um, it's just, I mean, at the apartment, I'm not sure if that's possible. And to really like make this go any, even further, um, let me show you guys, <laughs> hold on. Uh, let's see. Uh, let me show you. There, you guys didn't see a modem router for a reason, and that's because um, this is like early, like living by yourself. Even though I've been living by myself for like a good few years, I have it in here. There we go. So there you go. This is the modem router that I got from Xfinity. That's my second one because um, I wasn't aware that I had to switch. Um, see, when you set up your service for um, Xfinity or Comcast, you have to. Um, you have to put in an address and so I thought that was just like okay It's just to show you I'm a real person, but apparently you have to switch it to your new address every single time And so this is my uh, third apartment. So in this apartment they canceled my service So I had to um, I fucking forgot my phone So I had to walk all the way to the Xfinity store last time I did that because I called on the phone or <clears throat> I had to call on the phone and um, They basically said you have to do this in person. You can't do this over the phone. It's like oh fucking great I don't have my phone. I mean I don't have my car all I have is like my legs and my phone to show me where to go. So um, let's see, the Xfinity is, let's see, is that where it is? Yeah, it looks about right, yep, it looks about right. So here, I walked all the way to the Xfinity store, which was one hour and nine minutes away. It was a really long fucking walk. So I did that, you know, back and forth, and I thought I solved it. They said, yeah, you know, you don't have to pay a setup fee again. We're just going to say you're, you know, um, we're resuming your service. So, you know, I said, hey, you know, when you get back to your apartment, when you log on, like, you can just pay it again, and you're good to go. So like, I, said, I said, like, sure, yeah, great, that's perfect. I came back all the way here. I looked at my phone, uh, went on Xfinity, nothing. It's still the same, saying, like, you cannot access your plans because, you know, you're not a customer or whatnot. Like, this account that you're on is no longer active. So it's like, well, fucking great. So... I'm going to return this, so I'm, I'm not going to have any internet service here except for the um, one provided by the apartment. You know, you know um, <clears throat> Sterling Point provides its own um, apartment um, 
it's I guess it's like a local Wi-Fi, so I'm just gonna be using that. I've been using that, and you know it's perfectly fine, but it's no high-speed internet, so it would also make you know recording. If I, even if I did get my PS4 here, it would be really tough to, you know, just actually be able to play you know without lag and whatnot. I wouldn't trust it too because it's you know it's a public um, it's a public Wi-Fi. It's not you know it doesn't have a passcode. Like it's not secure, so I wouldn't even want to use it anyways for gameplay. So. Anyways, yeah, that's pretty much the um, the update for the apartment. So it's just me living here if I decide to record. Like, this is great. Like, I can talk in here and, like, there's no echo. There we go. Uh, there's no, like, echo, like, at um, University Square. So, like, this is perfect. Like, this is a perfect scenario to be doing this, but um, just a lot of problems. And, you know, with the internet, like, it's it's $51.40 a month. And I... If, if this, if this place already has Wi-Fi, why, why wouldn't I just use it? Because, you know, I am a college student. Like, all I really need it for, like, really need it for is, like, to get to Google Docs to submit assignments and to, you know, look up um, third-party sources for my papers and whatnot. Um, why would I need it for anything else? So, really, like, it's just an extra expense. Like, let's see, if we multiply that by 12, so that is... 600 and 612 and then we got the 40 so that is 48 so is that 600 dollars and 616 dollars and uh 80 cents i think did i do that right so yeah it's just like i don't know we'll just say i got it right <laughs> just to help my confidence but anyways so like that's a lot of money like that's every like that's every year i'm i'm, sp I'm spending on that modem router so I don't know, like, if it's already here, like, why wouldn't I just make use of what I'm already, I'm already paying for anyways, so, anyways, yeah, so this is just a big mess, um, <laughs> so that's basic, basically what I'm gonna say, like, trying to say, and what I am trying to say, or am saying, is that, um, yeah, like, I'm at a cross crossroads right now where, like, I could either keep going forward with the YouTube thing, or, you know, I could really, like, I've been focusing on investments, like, you know, bonds, stocks, um, cryptocurrency, <laughs> I've been doing that as well, I'll get into that some other time not right now but um yeah i am in the green so you know i've just been focusing on money like money like money is the great equalizer like you need you need money unfortunately like that's the way life is that's the way the economy is and that's the way the world is so i've just been focusing on being financially independent so you know it's coming it's clashing with youtube it's clashing with um you know <laughs> school kind of because i'm trying to make money i'm trying to make money any way i can like legally legally do not do it illegally do not do that guys so i've just been trying to make money so whether or not that's going to clash with youtube any more than it already has and like you know me being here at the apartment where i don't have any access to getting gameplay you know i can edit i can play pc games kind of i don't know how good the internet is for that so i don't really want to try that um i have been playing um home sweet home episode 2 like you guys have seen i'm very sorry there's so long it is one of those games where you play for long periods of time so i do apologize about that but you know i did love playing horror games in the past and i did have some let's plays here and there and it was an integral part of the channel and as much of a tangent as it as, as it is to do that, like to just go away from FPS and do that, I don't know if that's going to be a necessity in the future, but I mean, that's for me to find out. I just want to let you guys know in case like something takes a huge tangent, it's because like, hey, you know, I, I decided that life is more important and that I need to become fiscally and financially independent. I need to start worrying about money and I have to start worrying about investing. I need to start worrying about being independent. So. If that becomes an issue, I will definitely let you guys know, but um, I guess until then, guys, you know, sorry for this really, like, uh, serious talk. This isn't typical of the channel unless it's warranted, and I believe right now it's warranted because you guys watch the content, and you guys stop by. Like, you guys have been stopping by for years, like some of you guys, and, you know, you recently, like, I don't know how the fuck it happened, but, like, you got me to um, 100,000, over 100,000 views, and I need to make a thank you video on that. I will be making that special. The reason why I haven't, like, also the 600 sub one. <laughs> <laughs> I did that months and months and months ago. I crossed 600 subscribers and I didn't make anything special about that because for special videos I like to do a, do a giveaway. Um, I don't like throwing that word around because that word has been just completely dement like it's been completely just torn apart like bastardized and just like completely just destroyed by people using it to get publicity more attention to you know trick people into like commenting so their video gets more you know coverage and whatnot trying to fool the youtube algorithm algorithm and fool people into like commenting and like liking all the time thinking they're gonna get that one fucking gift card like i really that, that irks me the most and why 
uh, I almost feel like saying giveaways dirty because like they have like, oh, I'm giving away one prize. It's going to be $1,000 or one PS4 to one lucky person. Like, oh, if you really cared, why wouldn't you break that up? Like instead of paying for one PS4, um, break that up. Give away 30 $10 PSN gift cards. Like, there you go. More winners. More people are happy. You have, you're making a living off this. Why wouldn't you want to do that? Like these people are making it so you can live off of them. Like they're, they're the reason you're here. So why wouldn't you want to just, you know, show that extra effort. If you really cared, show the effort. So that's what I'm doing. I'm trying to get, you know, <laughs> it, it's a fair trade-off. If, you, if you've been here for a while, I'm sorry, I'm making this longer than it needs to be. But if you've been here for a while, you guys know how I do my giveaways. Um, I don't just walk in willy nilly and buy a gift card. I I use my time. Like I go on a, I go on a site like Grab Points, I'm um, Swag Bucks, Inbox Dollar, and I use my free time to get gift cards by doing surveys, by doing tasks, by watching their videos and whatnot. Because I believe that is a fair trade. Like anyone could just, you know, if you make some money, you could just walk in and buy a gift card. But I believe it, it truly means something when you really work for it. So that's why I waste, not waste. <laughs> I mean, it is kind of because some of the sites are really trashy and like it's like, why am I even here? But then I remember like, okay, I'm doing this because I'm giving back to you guys. But I use up hours and hours and hours and you know weeks and months of my time sometimes I don't do a giveaway for months at a time because it takes me months to get those gift cards so you know right now I'm almost there with the grab points one taking surveys watching videos and all that stuff you know downloading installing apps and actually playing the apps to get the points and whatnot so I'm doing that right now because you know that's fair like you guys use your time to watch my videos and I should use my time to you know show that like show appreciation you guys use your time I use my time to give back to you guys like that is that is a fair transaction so I believe you know you know every youtuber should be doing that but you know maybe I'm just you know have my hopes are too high like you know if, if you get something from people you know show a little appreciation and give a little back like how hard is that how hard is it to show appreciation but you know, it is what it is. We don't live in that kind of world, I suppose, you know, and, and YouTube, like, it's all about the money, you know? I mean, I was talking about money earlier, so I really have, I really can't say anything, but anyway, so um, giveaway hopefully soon, and thank you guys so much for helping me get to this point and for, you know, making this hobby so fun, for commenting, you know, just, it's great talking with you guys. Like, I do really enjoy that. Like, every single day I, you know, come home, you know, I'm sorry I don't comment, like, reasonably, like, often as I should, but, you know, I come home, you know, I check, or whatever I am, you know, apartment or home home, I check the comments, I reply, we have, you know, little conversations, and, you know, I enjoy that, I love that, I love interacting with you guys, and, you know, just you guys being nice enough to stop by and watch my videos, so, you know, I'm just gonna hopefully show that appreciation with, um, as many gift cards as possible, hopefully it's more than, um, three, um, I'm really working on it, guys, it's really tough to earn them from these sites, they really do make it tough, oh my god, the number of surveys, and god damn, but anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching the video, and this is just, you know, again, an update on what could possibly be happening in the future, um, whether or not YouTube continues, you know, make a video every single day, or maybe have to dial that, dial that back a little bit, um, whether or not I'm going, you know, 100%, you know, 50 school, 50 money, and I can't do YouTube, I really don't know. So I'll let you guys know when that happens. But until then, I will try my best to make a video every single day and to give you content you want to watch. But anyways, guys, um, thank you so much for watching this really long video. I'm, I'm sorry it's so long. But yeah, thank you guys so much. And like always, have an awesome day. I will see you all in the next one.